for those listening, if someone says, well, I have core values or I have our mission statement versus these operating principles, how do you kind of separate those? And what's the difference between those two things? So um, there are actually some really great articles on this. and But for me, the best thing is examples. So um, your values, I mean, there are tons of practices who have great mission, vision, vision, mission values. And so a value might be um, we, 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 you know, honor and respect um, the, the clinical work being done in the practice. I mean, that's like that, right? That's yeah. a core value. Um, mm-hmm. And an operating principle around that would be, so what do the behaviors look like that say we honor mm-hmm. that? Yeah, so it might be that um, it might be that when there is an issue, which never happens between the front desk and an assistant, the way we honor the clinical team is the front desk does not go back and start talking forcefully to that assistant in a public space. How many times have we seen that in practice? A bazillion. How does that show respect for what they do? No, no. And on the other side of the coin, um, when you're at the front desk, you don't want, and there there are people in reception or there's somebody right there, you know, checking out. The assistants should not be coming up to the front desk and speaking forcefully and or meanly or unkindly to the person at the front desk, like, why did you, we've heard this a million times, why did you screw up my schedule today? I am sick and tired of you screwing up my schedule. And if you ever do this again, I'm going to tell the doc and he is going to fire you. And then they storm away. That's not how we show respect for each other, right? So it's yeah. it's saying we don't do this or we do, typically I like to do it positively. Here's what we do when we have a problem. 